Welcome to the Texoma Excellence in Fine Art Scholarship brought to you by the Texoma Chevy Dealers. Today we're chatting with our fifth scholarship winner, artist Lexi Columbus from Tishomingo High School. Lexi is a brilliant artist. Let's dive into her artistic journey. So I would say my motivation towards you know, doing art since elementary um, is my dad. He, artist, you know, just, just kind of like a bloodline thing. And I just felt it ever since I was growing up that it was just something that I was supposed to do and I had a gift for. And uh, my dad, he always taught me how to do it, what to do with it, and what you can do with it. So he's my biggest motivation. Thank you, Dad. My Chickasaw heritage uh, really kind of helps my art because uh, um, my dad's Chickasaw, that's where I get it from. And he does a lot of Chickasaw art. He has his pieces in the museum downtown and he would show me and I just love like the beauty behind it because it's just it's it's me it's part of me and it always has been so it's it's really nice to kind of contribute and helping out what my people and I stand for I love helping out around the school like seeing my my like the things that I do around the school and everyone being like oh that's so cute and like stuff like that it it hypes me up I I love to see the feedback on it and like the ideas behind it are so cool. Like every year, different themes, I get to change it up. And it's awesome to have people like ask me for help. Be like, anytime someone's like, oh, I need someone to, to draw this or like, I need help with this. Like, I'm like, I could do it. It's, it's really fun to be the one that people like to look at for that certain kind of thing. If I'm good at art, then, then I guess I'm good in music because I'm getting these awards. And I was like, I want to get higher. I want to get as high as I can to be... You know, I want to be something with both of those. And the awards and the honors really helped me motivate myself to want to get higher in those. I did a struggle a little bit in 10th grade band with being in art and a few other things in choir, but I made the schedules align perfectly with enough to make my own personal art. And uh, it's just, it's kind of easy in the long run because I just, I care about all of those things together so it wasn't it wasn't too crazy <laughs> um my mentor my art teacher miss davidson i've been with her for you know three years and throughout those three years being in her class i've kind of i don't know she just when she praises me and like tells me about my art she also teaches me in certain ways like it's constructive criticism and that's something i always strive for because i i, I want to get better i i want to be one of the best. I want to make sure my art is the best thing hanging up and she really helps me does that. She gives me tips and it's just, uh, she gives me lessons specifically um, about like, you know, shading and like how to do wrinkles. I struggle with like wrinkles in clothing and like drawing or painting that and she has given me certain lessons that really help me adapt to the changes that I'm not used to in my art and paintings. It's just, it's really easy to get into something like art or painting like that I love to do. It's just so easy to get wrapped up in my own little world and make whatever the world I have in my brain onto a piece of canvas or a piece of blank paper. Uh, time management. Time management is uh, the key to pursuing, you know, a fine arts uh, kind of pathway. If you really have a passion for it, always make time for it. It's, it's worth it. It's worth it in the end. I felt that Lexi was the perfect candidate for the Chevy scholarship because she is really talented and she plans to pursue art in her future. Um, she really enjoys creating art and uh, I really thought that this could help her achieve her dreams.